Do you watch for the signs in your life that are calling for a change? Overstress, not sleeping, sickness, injury, persistent anger and sadness. This is usually a sign of a need for emotional decluttering and a shift in our mindset. Examine what you have disowned about living your purpose. With clarity over this problem, you can make a plan to bring your life back in alignment with your purpose. To do this, you have to examine the limiting beliefs that you assumed when you experienced life disappointments. When you had a goal or a desired outcome and it didn't go the way that you wanted, we often experience some disappointments and we may not process that information in the most appropriate way. And that's what causes us to have inner emotional trauma and forms a lot of the basis of our beliefs about what we are capable of and what is possible. Experiencing those disappointments in life are inevitable, but when we can learn how to properly process that information and those experiences, we are going to be able to stay aligned with our life purpose. These disappointments are usually things that happened that challenged our ability to work towards our dreams or what we could also call our life vision or goals. Don't fret. These are common experiences in our society and this is what you are here to overcome if you choose to do so. Our greatest potential is held back by the mental stances that we take towards solutions to our problems. What I'm talking about is let's say there's a problem that we want to solve and we want it to be done a certain way or our minds can only view solving it via one means. But in reality, there's a bunch of other ways we can solve that problem, but our mind might just not be open to it. So by shifting our mindset and being open to overcoming our problems and our obstacles via new ways or with a different time frame or with different strategies, we are setting ourselves up to be able to overcome it much more easier and quicker than if we were to just stay stubborn and only want it to be solved by the way that we've been envisioning. So many people never open to a new way of overcoming their problem. The message doesn't reach them that they have the ability to make a change in their life. This is called a life rut. What happens is once we reach a certain point, we feel we must submit to our circumstances and we tell ourselves, this is just the way it is. This is just how reality is. This is how adulthood is. You have to work that job that bores you all day long with that manager that you don't like because you have to pay the bills. There's no other way that you can live your life and pay the bills easily. It's false. It's a limiting belief. And this is where we need to open to other solutions. Unfortunately, the majority of people endure these life circumstances their entire life. The message doesn't reach them that they have the ability to change or they refuse to accept that. All you have to do is reframe your mindset about what is possible, make some consistent action in your life to work towards it, and change starts to happen. For example, I used to say I wanted to write and make videos for a living, but I, as a young creator, thought the only way that I can make that career happen is if I write either a famous book or create a famous low budget movie that becomes instantly famous, propelling me into fame and stardom and all the money would come and I'd be able to do whatever I want with it. Truth is, I didn't see all of the obstacles I had put on myself about making that possible. Also, I was not open to other ways of achieving that goal by just writing or making videos about something that is true to me, that I'm passionate about, and sharing that with the world without some giant expectation attached to it, like uh, the need for some giant reward to come from every single project or immense praise. It's like, no, you need to make a bunch of projects, get your footing, figure out your natural rhythm and style. You know, if you do this, you can find yourself being fulfilled by what you create and also be delivering value to other people in your creations by sharing your authentic message. Creative ruts or any life rut where we experience sustained unhappiness for a prolonged period of time are inevitable. It's part of the human experience. It becomes our challenge to rise from the rut. This presents us with a massive growth opportunity. 
To rise from a rut, we need to have clarity about what led us here. And then from this understanding, we can plan a route forward with a mindset shift. This mindset shift is what energizes us in the process of change. Just because our life didn't happen the way that we had envisioned it, doesn't mean we can't accomplish our goals and fulfill our life vision by some other beautiful and mysterious way. Rather than just focus on the outcome that you want for your life vision, focus on visualizing the process, the steps along the way, because when you compare yourself to just the big picture to where you are now, you're going to feel defeated, you're gonna feel like it's impossible, and you're gonna stay stuck in your rut. So you need to visualize the steps and the checkpoints along the way to getting there and then work towards that little by little, small acts, celebrate those small acts and deeds that you do for yourself, thank yourself, continue the effort, and trust in the process that if you keep visualizing that, that, that route forward, that process of change, you will one day arrive at that vision that you have for yourself and achieve your goals. So in short, it helps to have a plan, this plan needs to start with small steps. You should celebrate and recognize your efforts with every step. Don't judge yourself against the big picture because you'll overwhelm yourself. And trust that we can adapt our efforts and our mindset to achieve anything that we want. Accept the pain of the past with the obstacles that you experience, but also accept the opportunity that you're given each and every day that the planet rotates back into the light. You can start again. You can continue this on the next day and with sustained effort, you can accomplish your life vision. So all this info is from a newsletter that I recently wrote where I talk about content creation, storytelling, finding our purpose and having clarity over what we can offer the world and delivering authentic content messaging to achieve our life purpose. Because I do thoroughly believe that the wave of the future is having the ability to create authentic content that delivers your authentic message and resonates with your ideal audience. So if you're interested in signing up for that newsletter, you can go to bradysnow.com. I have opt-in forms on my website. You can put in your email and you'll be on the list. I'll also have links below this in the description. On my most recent letter, I talked about my experiences with rising from my creative rut. So you can check that out if you want to hear my personal story. And yeah, that's all I've got for today. If you like this, please like, subscribe, let me know in the comments what you thought of this video. If there's anything you'd like me to cover in the future, let me know. And I'll see you in the next video.